What's good, YouTube? You know who it is. Chris Jones, representing Pop Chasers. So check it out. It's time to show you guys the recipe right here. I promise you this in my last uh, Shopping with Chris video. I think you're going to absolutely love this shit right here. Macro friendly. Whether you're bulking or cutting, I believe you can fit this in your macros. Okay, You just got to adjust things. Obviously, if you're cutting, you may want to use less carbs, less potatoes, uh, um, less refried beans. Depending on the macros you're on. It all depends on the macros you're on. I know plenty of people that are able to cut on 300 grams of carbs. So like I said, you can adjust accordingly. Okay, I'm going to have the macros at the very bottom of the description for you guys. Check this out. All the ingredients I use in this uh, recipe right here, I put on my fitnesspal.com, so it's very accurate. Check that out. See, bam, 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 bam. Like I told you, macros will be at the very bottom of the description for the ones that happen to give a fuck. Here's all the ingredients you're gonna need right here. First, you're gonna need some liquid egg whites, okay? I went with two servings of liquid egg whites. One serving is 46 grams, three tablespoons. So that means we need 92. All right, so we're going to go 92 grams, which is two servings of liquid egg whites. Up, show them that. 94, close enough, okay? Close the fuck enough, all right? You're not going to be fucking fat because you went from 92 to 94, okay? Get the fuck out of here. Shit, fuck this shit, man. Anyway, so check it out, man. I showed you this in my last Shopping with Chris video. Extreme wellness, high fiber, low carb tortillas, okay? Very macro friendly. We got some frozen potatoes, okay? Just like regular potatoes, except for they're already sliced and peeled and diced up, ready to go. No oil added or nothing, all right? Zero grams of fat, 16 grams of carb per serving, whatever serving you use, okay? We got some lean ground turkey right here, 93.7 lean turkey. You can go leaner or you can go fattier, depending on what you prefer. But this right here, in my opinion, is the perfect... Um, is the perfect ratio. 93.7 is lean, but not too lean where it tastes like crap. I've tried 99.1 lean turkey, let me tell you, it tastes like fucking dog food. Not worth it. You're gonna eat 99.1 turkey, just go with chicken breast, okay? This right here. This is a uh, Gebhardt refried beans. Zero fat, okay? I got this at Walmart. You can get this at Walmart, Amazon. I'm pretty sure you can get this at any grocery store in the USA. Good shit right here, man. Zero fat, refried beans. Just pretty much pinto beans with salt smashed down, ready to go. I love this shit, man. Now, if you can't find the fat-free, to be honest, it's not that much difference. The ones, with, the ones that have fat in it is only like two or three grams of fat per serving. So it's not gonna be a big deal, but if you can get that fat-free, go ahead and get that. And last but not least, fat-free shredded cheese, guys. Okay, and I'm not gonna be, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you. It's not as good as that real good fatty cheese. However, look at the protein. Look at the protein. You see that? Nine grams of protein, zero grams of fat. So I'm not necessarily doing it for the taste. It'll taste bad, okay? I'm doing it to give more cheese texture to the meal, but most of all, increase the protein amount. Okay, the real good way to boost the protein in your meal. All right, so we got fat-free cheese. If you can't find fat-free cheese, go with the low-fat cheese. Low-fat cheese is only about six grams of fat per serving, depending on how much you use. So we got fat-free cheese, ground turkey, we got refried beans. We got the hash browns, AKA sliced potatoes. And we are ready to go, okay? We're gonna start off heating our skillet. We're gonna cook this turkey. Now check this out. Before I cook this turkey, let me let you know. I already have turkey cooked, okay? I could have easily just said, hey, cook turkey. Yada, 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 yada. However, we got a lot of new bodybuilders out here, man. Like I told you a while back. There's a body good born every day. Some people do not know basic shit. So I thought it would be kind of cool to cook the turkey, show you the seasoning that I like to use. It will make the video a little longer, but at least we can help more people. All right. So let's go ahead and cook this turkey. And bam. Before the skillet gets hot, let me roll up my long sleeve pump chasers fitted hoodie. <laughs> Shameless plugs, man. Okay. So. Let's go ahead and get some black pepper right here. Bam. Bam. All right. You can go with regular salt or you can go with this Creole seasoning. This shit will change your life. Look at that. Tony's. 
Get some of this Tony's Creole seasoning, guys. Delicious. Okay, so we got some of these in here. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, now let's get some of this Mrs. Dash seasoning in here. Mrs. Dash is actually sodium free. In case you happen to give a fuck, let's get some garlic and herb. You can use as much as you want to use, guys. You know, with salt, you kind of want to pinch here and there, sprinkle here and there. You don't want to overdo the salt. But with this shit right here, you put as much as you fucking want, man. So we're going to put that garlic and herb. A little bit of onion powder. Alright, and that's all, man. Just some uh, pepper. I use some of this Tony's. I use some of this onion powder, and I use some of that Mrs. Dash, okay? So be sure to go get some of that right there. Now, before the skillet gets hot, hurry up. Ha! Ah, bam! Mix it together real good. Get that flavor in there. Get that flavor locked in. Ah! 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 Bam! All you gotta do. The meat kind of warm, so that skillet's getting hot. Better hurry up before she get hot. Or you can mix it in a bowl, you know, but I like to live a little dangerously, man. Just a little bit. Alright? But there it is. We got the skillet up on high. Once the shit starts sizzling, I'm going to get my spatula, spin it around, flip it around until there is no pink left. Y'all stay Light tuned. Uh. Alright guys, well check it out. Take a look. See how it's starting to get brown? You still got some pink in there. Get your skillet, smash it down, smash it down, and just keep rolling around until all the pink is gone. You want everything nice and brown, okay? Don't want to get sick. Now while this shit is right here still cooking, let's go ahead and get these frozen potatoes and put them in the microwave for two minutes so they can defrost. Once they defrost, we're going to put it on the skillet so these potatoes get nice and crispy. Alright, so we're going to do that right now. Two minutes, guys. Alright. Potatoes gonna defrost. While that's defrosting, check this out. Let's go ahead and get the skillets nice and warm. Put some pram spray over here. Alright. Got the pam spray. Let's get the egg scrambled up. Okay, got the egg whites. Let's get them scrambled up. Bam! Egg whites nice and scrambled up. Put a little salt in them eggs so they won't be all bland tasting. Come over here. Bam, just a little bit of salt to get them going. Bam. All right, got the skillet right here nice and hot. All right, potatoes are nice and defrosted. Now, there's still a little bit of ice in them. I mean, you can still feel, they, they still feel kind of cold if you want to. Put them in for another two minutes if you want. But honestly, this hot skillet is going to get all that ice off of here. Look. I know y'all hear that. I know you hear that. Sound like it's about to go down. Oh, yeah. I wasn't going to show people this. I didn't want to make motherfuckers jealous. Y'all already got enough haters as it is. But I guess I got to, man. We got those onions in here. Ah, just a little bit. Oh, shit. Now, look. If you do not like onions, disregard this part. Okay? But I love onions. Especially grilled onions. Okay? So, rinse it off. All right. So I got my onions and potatoes in here. Man, this shit about to go down, boy. Chef Jones is back. Chef Jones is back. Go get scrambled up. Make sure it's nice and scrambled up. Oh, yeah. See that? Bam. Let's put this egg to the side. This egg is done. Let's put it to the side. All right. Let's lower the heat right here. Look at that. And let those potatoes get nice and crisp up. Look, you know what? Put a little more pan spray on there. Just, you know, bam. There you go. There you go. I know I understood people who don't like onions. Man, man. Me either, man. It's either it ain't that big of a deal or it's just, I don't mind the taste. But them same people that... Motherfucker don't like pussy with hair on it. <laughs> now, we grew up eating everything. Uh, ain't no big deals like fuck it. <laughs> yeah. 
You get my motherfucker who will fucking fight you over putting onions in their food. Motherfucker. You know what I mean? Like, me, it's always been with us. Well, like, physical altercation with a goddamn fast food worker because they put onions in their shit. I haven't seen that. Yeah. Motherfucker be serious about some onions. Whether they want them or don't want them. Look at that, that personal and close view. Look at that. Look at that. Meat, look at that. See that brownness? Meat's ready to go. Just make sure we chop it down. You, want, you don't want the meat all chunky. Just chop it down a little bit. Before you start, make sure your potato is defrosted and it's not cold. There we go. So check this out. The meat's cooked, potatoes and onions are cooked, and the egg is cooked. We're gonna get this egg. Come on in. Bam! Egg, potatoes, and onions. Now, this recipe, when I put it in my fitness pal, I did six ounces of turkey. You can do more or you can do less, but you gotta track it yourself. Okay? So let's go ahead and weigh out six ounces of turkey. Here we go. I, I bet I hit six right with this. Here we go. Bam! Fuck! I don't know what's there it is. Fuck that. 6.15. I can live with that. I'll be able to sleep at night with 6.15. No big deal. Okay? I don't get Teddy's man <laughs> point five votes. You're going to go to the doctor for that fat loss surgery and be like, why you have bitch titties? Well, I tried to get six hours of chicken in. <laughs> I just killed the head at 6.15 and it's more of a lot. <laughs> Guys, don't over obsess about the petty shit, okay? Not that serious. So the point of the scale and the macros is to try to stay close to consistent as possible. Not to be over obsessive. It's not to have OC fucking D. It ain't that fucking serious. Bad. Onions, potatoes, eggs, six ounces of meat. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can eat this right here. You know what? Video oh. You feel me? Video oh. You can eat this shit right here. Get a little hot sauce, a little ketchup, and you're good. Yeah. Don't be jealous, guys. I already know somebody gonna dislike my video for no reason. It looks like I got some good ass food over here. That shit look good. No, it is good. It looks good because it is good. Fuck Denny's. You come across your own kitchen. Shit. You don't gotta go to Denny's. I'm gonna do it like this shit. What? Oh, 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 this shit. Look at this, guys. Chop it down. Chop it down. Get it mixed up nice and good. Okay? Keep the heat on, guys. I had it on medium to high the whole time. Here's the corner. Because people, I can't forget we got people who don't know how to cook. I had Here's medium. Here's high. I had it right in the middle. The whole time when I was cooking my eggs and my potatoes and my and my onions and shit. Now we're gonna go low because everything's pretty much cooked. Okay, we're gonna get the refried beans up in here. Let the refried beans get heated up, melt it down a bit, and we're gonna mix it up. Okay. Make sure you get you a no-stick skillet because if you use these beans on one of those old rusty ass skillets, shit's gonna be stuck to the pan. Get you a non-stick skillet. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna mix that up in here nice and good. Guys, again, man, you don't gotta get jealous. I'm showing you the game, I'm teaching you how it's done. I even gave you the macros. I mean, what more you gotta do? You just gotta go to the store and get the shit to make it, man. And if you don't wanna cook, you gotta be whole ready, though. Fan you a woman, you know what I'm saying? Get over the crib, show her this video, and she'll cook it for you. That's if you know what you're doing. That's if you got some game. You ain't got no game. Fuck, I guess you'll be the one to April cooking for her. You know, There's nothing wrong with that if you like to cook. You got a little game, man. You got a little game. All you got to do, get over the house. You feel me? Get, get that hip thrust action. That hip thrust action. Oh my God, you got to work legs, guys. You want some of that shit? They say, baby, I'm hungry. Say, what do you want? Show her this video. And say, can you make that for me? She'll go do it. Hey, man. Max. Life tip for Chris Jones, man. I ain't thinking this shit up. She'll do it. If you one of those guys, I don't know what the fuck you doing, though. You don't know what the fuck you doing. You can get in the bedroom, 
bitch just touching you like, oh, I just, <laughs> I don't want you to get mad, but I just came in my pants. You one of those, <laughs> you one of those motherfuckers. Ain't nobody cooking for your motherfucking ass, but your mama or some shit. You gotta go to mama house, show her this video, and get you one of these meals, but. You gotta know what fucking Whatever you gotta do, whatever your situation is, get it done. Yeah, whatever your situation is, get it done. This is purely optional. Okay? Purely optional. You do not have to do this, but I wanna share my secrets because I wanna change the game. Got jalapenos. Now y'all know I'm not really into jalapenos. I only got this because, you know, when a nice little Tina come over. <laughs> Play a little biggity biggity bum bum. Yeah, a little Tina come over and she's like, "What the jalapenos, Poppy?" <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> "Bam!" You feel me? So look at this. I'm at the portion. Did this shit open? I bought this shit three weeks ago. Is this shit open? No. Aye, aye, aye. I bought it for the Latinas, my nigga. The Latinas. <laughs> fuck that some jala. Fuck them jalapenos. But this shit right here though, these chilies. I've been fucking with that. Look at that. I've been using this shit. Aye. This is my second jar. Get you a nice. Keeping scoop of this shit right here. Look, 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 look. look. Ooh! Got a little Selena. Oh, one more time, one time, one time. Now, one more heap of scoop. Fuck that nigga. Ha! Huh. It is, it's, look, it's spicy, but it's not hot. It's not like burning your fucking tongue, fucking sweating hot. I hate that feeling. You know, it's nice, spicy flavor. You're gonna love that. Let me show you this, just in case y'all know what it is. You can get this at Walmart in the Spanish section. It's called Hatch Valley Frame Roasted Green Chilies, man. Will change your motherfucking life. You don't even feel like you on a diet, man. You can diet 10 years straight fucking with this type of shit. All right, so look at though. Got the green chili shit up in here. We're missing one thing. Can anybody guess? We're missing something. Cheese. That shit. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, I gotta fuck this shit, man. Damn! What? What? What happened? Man, that shit too damn good, man. G-A-L. Look, man. I just let this skillet, the refried beans hit me, that salt, the potatoes, and onions. Brandon, I almost came in my pants, ah! man. <laughs> Fuck, man. I'm done, man. Turn this shit off, man. I'm done. Fuck this shit, man. Hey, eat this shit, man. <laughs> now, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Look, cut the cheese. Like I said, if you can't get fat-free cheese, get low-fat cheese. But to be honest with you, if you can't get fat-free cheese, and you don't even want cheese, man, you can eat this shit just like this. You don't even gotta put cheese in this shit, but I'm gonna do cheese anyway. I want that protein. Bam, just let it melt a little bit. You don't gotta fucking mix it in. Just let it melt. Look, look, come on here. See the cheese up in here? All you gotta do is just flip it around. Let, let, that, let them hot potatoes and them hot beans soak that cheese in. Just flip it. You ain't gotta stir it. Just flip it, flip it, flip it. Smash it down, flip it, smash it down. There you go. This is for all of those kids out there who ain't got no big brother. I'm your big brother, goddammit. Shit. And some somebody say you ain't got no big brother. You say, hey, quit John, big brother. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright, there it is. Smashed in. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. That's a nice breakfast right there, man. That's a nice breakfast. Look at that. Look at all that food, man. Look at all that shit. Look at that. And it's delicious. G-A-L. I'm not just saying it because I made it. I'm saying it because it's the fucking truth. Okay? Now look at this. Get you a tortilla or two. But you can get you one. Put it to the side. See that? Bam. So what you can do is get some ketchup or some hot sauce or some shit. Eat this shit by itself. Right? Get you a tortilla. When you get to the last few bites, put that up in there. Roll it up. Like this. Ah, you feel me? And there it is, guys. Try this right here. I'm only asking one favor. If you make it, tag me on Instagram so I can like your shit. Okay? If you make this and don't hashtag, I don't even look at hashtags. Tag me, Beach Mo Jones. I will go to your shit and like it. I might even comment. Just show me some support. Like my shit. Let me know you appreciate my shit, alright? If you like this video, share it with your girlfriend so she can make this for you. Or share it with your mom, the people who can't fuck. You know, share it with your mom. She'll make it for you because she loves you. Granny. Right. Share it on Facebook. Spread the word that Chef Jones is back. Don't forget to like my shit. Comment, subscribe. Bye, 30 of them bitches. Holla back.
get 30 of them bitches minimum. <laughs> <laughs>